Tell him. Let's get him crunk. Chill. Let's get him crunk. Like Chill. and subscribe. Nick. Real Murder TV. Chill. Chill. Okay, guys, I want to speak on THO Gino. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of people know this. A lot of people don't know that. It's alleged that, you know what I'm saying, Gino and a couple of other people, you know what I'm saying, alleged got side and motor, you know what I'm saying. Uh, it's alleged that he's the, he's the hitter, you know what I'm saying. Gino was another hitter that was very, you know what I'm saying, getting busy. He was very dangerous to the ops. A lot of these guys, they cool with their own people, but they, they very dangerous to other people on the outside. You could be the weakest motherfucker inside the clique and be knocking your ops off, and they'll be like, damn, that boy was doing his thing, but, you know what I'm saying, he, he didn't get the attention, you know what I'm saying, that he got. But, you know what I'm saying, but it's said that THL Gino, you know what I'm saying, last the killer of Motor Inside. And um, when he died, they started putting rest in peace side and motor. Uh, you gotta understand, motor, it was probably a little hit out on him anyway because, not motor, but on side because um, he, he got away and he, he can witness, he can identify the shooters who was there that day. He the one that actually told everybody who, who shot TB. He knows who shot TB, so all the ops knew who got TB and who tried to shoot him. So they know who, the, who they were looking for, you know, at the time. Or whatever, but yeah, THF Gino, rest in peace to all these guys, man. It never ends, right?